hello everyone you're welcome this is kingsley from kingsbird designs if you're just joining me for the first time please ensure you subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit on the notification bell so that you get notified each time i upload new video okay in the last tutorial if you actually noticed i sh this is where we stopped in the last tutorial where i showed you how to design this your website up to this level so in today's tutorial i'm going to be showing you how to animate this particular website if you look at the previous one we did when we just open the website it just pop up like that without any animation on it so i'm going to be showing you how to animate any part of your website it could be any the the images the box any web even the letters you can animate animate any of them that you want so i'm going to be showing you that right away now i'm going to be going to my home we are going to animate this particular website or everything in this website we animate it one after the other so now let me say i want to start with this button for my this particular tutorial i'm going to start with the button first so i'm going to start with this let's say once i click on the button i'm going to come to where we have our advance once you come to advance you are going to see this you are going to close this now what we'll be clicking on is motion effect you are going to click on this place we have motion effect so click on the motion effect then you see we are having our default that entrance default just click on the default then it's going to pop up this for you so now what you're going to do you can choose any of this particular effect you can decide to scroll you see a lot of them to choose from but for the sake of this tutorial i'm going to be using let's say this one should slide from let me see i'm going to be using let's say slide let me give you a full screen if you say slide from up let's say if, since i'm using this it should slide from the right let me say from the right you see how it comes when you say slide from the right then if you say slide from the left you can see how it comes so now i will decide this one should slide from the left when it's coming then one thing you are going to also notice now let me click on this one and make this other one go to advance then motion effects then now you are going to click on now the other one was from the left this one you will make it from the right it's going to come from the right why this from the left so now if we try to let me see how to preview it and see this is is still okay the way it is now i'm going to close this now let's do something now let me also do the same thing to this one here so that i will now refresh the website so that you see how it looks like now on this let me say welcome to on this one i'm going to advance then motion effects now i'm going to make use of let's say this one should just fit in it should just fit in you can see how it comes it just fits in so now I'm going to make that, I think I'm okay with that one here. Let's say this one too, I'm going to make it fade in also. At once all the whole text or that heading text to be the same kind of animation. Then this should maybe come from under. And then motion, then I'm going to click on Let's say fading from up. Or oh, let me just make it. That way, and let me say this the line. I'm going to make the line also fits in. So they will have almost the same kind of animation on that particular one. So now, let me read updates this particular website and show you how this particular website looks like so after showing you this we'll be going into 
building up the remaining aspect of this particular website remember i told you we are not this is not really the end of this this is like just like one section of this particular home page you are actually trying to build and don't forget i actually told you i'm going to be showing you the hardware of which this the hardware i'm actually showing you how to create everything on your own step by step one after the other after this stick just stick around when we are done with this particular home page i'm going to be showing you maybe why creating the other pages such as our about an other section of this particular website and probably i will be using a much more faster approach to, so you got to so that you have to learn both the easy way and also the hard way to create the website the home page once we well, are time you see whatever you want to be creating these other pages use this is, you can still use the same approach I use for these other pages for the home page but I just want to use the home page to show you the hard way of creating this particular website so now let me since it has finished updating let me refresh my website and show you how it looks like this time around so let's refresh it okay so you can now see how my website actually comes in after when it's come you can now see it's having some motions in it let me refresh it once again okay just watch and see sorry my system is you can see how it comes in so you can now see how it comes in now so let me i can add some delay to this particular animation maybe you want maybe you want to come before another one that's like you can see in this one they came at the same time one from here and this other one and they reached this particular point at the same time let's try and see something i'm going to show you something now maybe i'll make one to delay maybe one should come first before the other one starts coming let me show you how to do something like that but i think this other way i did it so right now is actually the a very better approach so let me show you now let you see so once you click on the button itself advance this one was slide from the left now i'm going to come to you see animation duration you see animation duration so now i'm going to click on the animation duration you can see i'm going to leave it as normal the way it is then on this place we say animation delay now one thing you should notice if i should enter something like in few if i want it one second it's going to be each one second is one thousand so i'm going if i enter something like one thousand that is a second you get me a one thousand is a second then if i want something like one and a half second it should be one thousand five hundred then one you can see the higher you increase it the just notice one just take note each second is a thousand so if you are you want it less sad than one second you have to reduce it maybe to something 500 or or you want it even faster than that you just have to reduce the numbers so now let me say i want this one to come the usual the default way let me say i want it to come after one sec one second this one should come after one second then on this other one i'm going to delay this one after this one comes one second this one should follow maybe i'm going to make this let me say something on this one i'm going to make it something like let me say 1000 should i say 750 let me make it 1750 what will happen here if you let me show you what happens here now this will actually arrive then after this arrive after some little seconds this follows let me refresh the website and show you okay now let me refresh the website so that you see how it looks like now click on refresh watch what happens now on this particular website you will notice that one of them this one comes first before this other one came this one came got to this place before this one actually came so now let's refresh it once again so that you see how it looks like just watch and see 
so you see the difference this one actually came first came in before this one finally arrived so now i'm going to return it to the huge default with the first one i did because i prefer it that way two of them should come should land at this particular spot at the same time so i'm going to go back and return it back to how it was initially so i'm going to make it maybe 1000 i'm going to make it 1000 then same thing to this other one 1000 say so let me update it so now let me now go and refresh the website and see so that you see the difference between this the two of them so just take notes you see both of them landed to at this particular spot at the same time because of the timing i gave to it so now just that is just simply the simple simple way how to animate your website so as we go along building the other pages i'll be showing you some other creating adding some animations to every other part of this particular tutorial so you get to learn more of the animation skills more different animation i'll be adding to this particular website so the same approach you can apply to in the delay to all this maybe you want one of them to appear before another you can just play along with the delay that is just how you do all this animation if you're still watching this video and you have not yet considered subscribing to my channel please hit on the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so that you get notified each time i upload new videos this is how i'm going to stop in this particular tutorial don't forget to watch the next video where i'm going to be building all this the many aspect of this particular website together with all the animation so now this is in case you have any difficulty or any question you want me to any part of this video you want me to actually explain more or you have any difficulty anywhere just comment in the comment box below i'll try my best to see how to respond to you until next time bye for now